I'm going to a Depeche Mode concert and thought I'd make an old 90s look and a newer, fresher version. So using the Going Coconuts palette, I used that pinkish tone and brush it all over my lid. And I have a black and white shirt because that's what I would have worn in the 90s. So I'm brushing it all over my lid, which gives no dimension. It's just there. You can already see a difference. Now on the left side, I wore very heavy, cakey makeup and used a pressed powder to set it, to make it pale and non-dimensional. Look at the difference on the other side of my face. So for eyeliner, I used the old L'Oreal eyeliner I used to buy back in the 90s. It's just there. And it just makes the eye look down. Now for the updated look, you're going to use the same shade. You're going to put it above the crease and always point it up to the sky. It's the same shade. Okay, so here I am brushing it above, okay, using a smaller brush and a little darker color. Dab, 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 and blend, blend, blend to give it dimension, to make it look modern. Okay, you want the eye to go up, okay? Using a flat angled brush, I'm going to do the eyeliner with a powder, same palette, darkest brown. Using a paper as a stencil, I'm going to draw the line and fill it in to make it look like a winged eyeliner. And it, yes. And now a flatter brush using the lighter brown color and you're going to smudge it under the eye, point it up, always point it up. With a very flat brush, you're going to use it for the inner eye, for the bottom part of the eye. And I use the lightest shade. Here is the mascara. And I put it on both eyes. I put a little on the left because I wouldn't have even worn mascara, honestly, back then. Huge difference. Now, I did do half a face of one foundation and half a face of another. Very cakey, very dry, and on the right, very dimensional. Here is my Tarte palette. This is for contouring. You're going to contour very, very high on the face for the new look. And around, anywhere that you want to hide, we have jowls as we get older. Contouring the nose here. And on the left side... It's going to down. I wouldn't have even worn um, a contour or a blush on the left. Here's a blush, also very high on the cheek. The higher, the better. Okay, and even around the temple a little bit. Nothing on that side. Very big fluffy brush to set your makeup on the updated side with a loose powder. There you go. Just dabbing it on. You're not going to cake it on like on the left side. There's a huge difference. Look how glowy it is on the updated side and how matte. And it makes you look older. Lipstick. Here we go. Brown liner. Yes, I remember the look and I did do this when I was in the 90s. And a light color. So you're not even matching. You're making it look you know, very, very distinct. So that's the old look. The new look is a much more, a color that matches your lips and the lip color much better. Putting the same lip color. And then to make the lips look glowy and not wrinkly since we're a little older, you're going to put some gloss. Gloss is always beautiful. And it plumps your lips as well. So here it is, left side, old look, new, uh, right side, new look, and it's completely different. I hope to look like that for my Depeche Mode concert.